I'm sorry for interrupting what you were just about to watch, but my name is Nate Nogler from The Most Reliable News Source, and we have some breaking news for you today. For the next three weeks, or however long I am off school due to coronavirus, there will be three uploads a week. One on Monday, one on Wednesday, one on Friday. So subscribe, hit the notification bell so you don't miss any, and hope you enjoy the video. second day of quarantine, out of three weeks. This is Milo. He's very happy that I'm home consistently, as you can tell. Before we get started with the video, I'd like to make an important announcement, alright? For the next three weeks, we I am in quarantine, outside school. Okay, well, I'm not technically not quarantine. It's just three weeks off school, okay? Whatever. Call it whatever you want, alright? Three weeks off school, I have nothing better to do, okay, I'm binging Brooklyn Nine-Nine, nothing there to do. I decided I'm going to make three videos a week, on Monday, Tuesday, no, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, alright? Three videos, we're going to go bam, 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 we're going to hit them all out, okay? It's going to be insane, I'm sorry, I'm going a little bit crazy, it's been, like, you know, it's only been two days, but it's... <laughs> Welcome to the video. Today... We're going to be talking about the three most awkward moments that I've had in my life. I've had many awkward moments. This would be a 10 hour video if I could share all of them. I don't even know all of them. Because I'm a very awkward person. This is the second time I had to record this video to make it even uh, make me even a little bit more crazy for you guys. Because the first time I only had the audio coming out of the left ear. Bam! Left. BAM! Right, opposites. Left, right, sorry. <laughs> Anyways, here we go, let's do it! Just so you guys know, on a second note, my cat would not shut up for the duration of this video. So, at the very end, I'm going to have a compilation of me screaming SHUT UP at the cat because he, he would not shut up at all. Anyways, hope you guys enjoy the video. So, the very first uh, story takes place- SHUT UP CAT! No one cares who asked your opinion! No one! SHUT UP! I love you, but shut up, please. The very first story uh, takes place on my birthday. Uh, when we were recording one of the very last seasons, or one of the very last episodes of the last season for Addison, which is a show where I was a second main character in it, okay? It's my birthday. It's my birthday. And, um, it's the very, very last couple days, right? So, all the actors sitting there on the sofa, there's about three of us that, there that day at that time, right? I was in the middle. They bring out a cake. I'm assuming it's for my birthday, but... Turns out it was, you know, because it was the very last day of filming, or last second to last day or something. And I'm, I'm not very smart. So I say, thanks for the cake, guys. Ah! I say, thanks for the cake, guys. And everyone else is like, it's not for you. And I'm like, oh. <laughs> I'll just say that everyone was quiet for a good couple minutes. And that, that was very, 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 very awkward. God, if I just used common sense, I probably would have known that. Most of these stories just me not using common sense and just saying things. And then turning everything awkward. Uh, the second most awkward story, this is a little bit of a long one. This thing called Team Takeover at the Armour Sportsplex goes from 7 till 10. It's completely free. Right, this cat hair is floating because it's a fat cat. SHUT UP! Um, SHUT UP! I'm gonna make a montage at the end of this video. Stay tuned. Montage for every single time I told that stupid cat to shut up. SHUT UP! Um, so. SHUT UP! SHUT UP! Okay. It's a single team takeover, Diamond Sports Flex, okay? It's from 7 till 10. Alright? It's 
completely free. You go to the gym, you go to the pool, and go whatever you want, okay? So me and a couple of my friends showed it to the friends. I forget who was there at that time, but shout out to them. You know who you are, okay? Uh, I was there with them. Uh, it was about 10.05, which was after the leaving time. And everyone wanted to go to the change room to get their stuff, right? Because we left it all in there after we came out of the pool. So we tried to go in the change room. It was locked to talk to one of the employees. They said they could let us in. You know, they unlocked change room for us. Very nice of them. Thank you for that. And then we walked into the change room. Uh, we got our stuff. I tried to unlock my lock from the locker, okay? Uh, I couldn't get it open. The password for the lock was nuts. Yeah, you classy, right? So, <laughs> I couldn't get it open. SHUT UP! Why don't you tell you to shut up again? Come here. Come here. The password was nuts, right? And I tried to type it in, it wouldn't open. No matter how much I tried, the lock would not open. We pulled on so hard, all of us tried to type it in, and it wouldn't open. I know for a fact the password is nuts. You can't forget a password that's nuts, okay? It's impossible. Why are you up here and you're just gonna struggle if you don't want to be down there and you're just gonna meow? Are you starving? You're not starving, you're overweight. Sorry. Anyway, so we don't have to get it open. We had to call the lady. What the f We had to call the lady over, right? Jesus Christ. We had to call the lady over. To help us open the lock in the male's change room she couldn't get it open she her finger was bleeding because she was pulling on the lock so hard okay none of us could get the lock open it's literally impossible um i go up to get the person who has bolt cutters the two ladies come up and meet me and they go hey nay no they go uh so turns out that your lock was actually open the entire time you see to turn it and i'm like It was, it was really weird and really awkward. Also, Max, I'm not sure if you're watching Max, I think that girl might have been your sister. Because she works in the Sportsplex. So I'm not sure about that. Don't quote me on that. Just saying. All right. So, final story. There's this game called Star Trek Bridge Crew. It is not a big game, all right? There's about 150 normal players. So basically, if you're a consistent player, you know everybody, okay? You, you know everybody. You know everybody, like, what they're like, what their skills are and everything, right? You basically play with everyone that plays the game, okay? It's a very, very, very small game, so it's a very small chance you'll actually get in the game with somebody, right? So, I was in the game with this guy. He's a new guy. I was chatting with him. He was telling me about some of the people that he played with who were kind of like, you know, talking about other players. And I'm like, have you ever played with this guy in ASL 2099? I'll give you a little uh, backstory. ASL 2099, he was a jerk. He was a complete jerk. He was so mean. You shut up! He was a complete jerk. He treated you like crap. He would kick you from the party if, like, you did anything wrong at all. What in the name of God do you possibly want? He, he, was, just, he was just a complete jerk. You just don't want to be around him. He's such a great captain, though, because if you're with him, you're guaranteed to win. He was amazing. So he, the guy, anyways, flashback, whatever, right? So the guy was like, no, I haven't played with that guy. What do you like? And I'm, I told him, I'm like, oh, he's a great guy. Why are you scratching at the door? How many disabilities can you have at the same time? Anyways, he was, um, he was like, no, I haven't played with him. And so I was, he, I explained what he was like. I just explained what I did to you guys. And then he was like, quiet for a couple seconds. And he's like, dude, I'm like, what? He's like, I am ASL 2099. <laughs> I changed my username. <laughs> God, why have you so awkward about everything I do? Yeah, of course I had to say it to that exact guy. Good God. I'm so stupid. I'm so stupid. And it was a joke. We, you know, we all laughed about it afterwards, but it was very awkward. There was a good 30 seconds that we were both staring at each other. So it was in VR, so we were both staring at each other. It was very, 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 very awkward. Anyways, that's all my stories. Thank you for watching. Um, right now, we're going to put a little compilation of every single time that stupid cat meowed, and I told him to shut up and play that quick. Shut up, cat. It was my face. Shut up, cat. No one cares.
I love you, but shut up, please. Who asked your opinion? No one. Shut up! Okay. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Mark, you so mean. Shut up! What in the name of God do you possibly want? Shut up! Oh, he's a great guy. Why are you scratching at the door? How many disabilities can you have at the same time? Thank you guys for watching the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Follow me on the platforms. I'm going a little bit crazy. That's why I have three videos a week. Three videos a week. I don't know if I mentioned. How many videos are there a week? Three. How many? Three. 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 Three videos a week. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Bye. Hello, everybody. There are three major social platforms you guys should be subscribed and following me on. If you want to show me your dedication, Instagram and Nate underscore white underscore noggler. Twitter at NMWN17 and Twitch at NMWN17. Also, follow and like, subscribe and like the video, please. I know I'm dedicated to you. Are you guys dedicated to me? Just so, just to show how dedicated I am to you guys, I'm gonna push my face inside the snow pile.